Hello there, here we are with our patient Mark. Mark just stopped by for a 10 day follow up visit uh, to get his stitches out. We did a max harvest hair transplant procedure uh, 10 days ago and uh, we just took the stitches out about five minutes ago. So we're gonna show you the progress with the healing and we're gonna ask the patient uh, how his experience was. So how was the experience for you, my friend? I was excellent, it was excellent. Uh, didn't really hurt too bad. Uh, the aftercare was pretty easy and I'm um, feeling pretty good right now. So just uh, obviously it's a waiting game now and I'm looking forward to the results. Awesome, okay. So uh, what Mark came in for was he was uh, wanting to restore his hairline that was receding. And he also wanted to help to reframe his face with the uh, temples and we're gonna show you what that looks like. Um, when we did the Max Harvest Hair Transplant for my patients that follow along, we always want to move as much hair as we possibly can move from the back of the head to the front of the head and we're taking those good hairs that are programmed not to be sensitive to the hormone conversion that causes a loss to the area where they have a good blood supply and they grow fine. So I'm just going to show, we just took the mark stitches out literally just now and this is how it looks underneath. The shaved hairs you're seeing here currently um, were hairs that were shaved down all the way to the skin on the day of his procedure in order for us to get the follicles out without having the long hairs in our way. Um, the suture line there is, would be the line that runs down the middle of this area. My comb is right over the top of it right now. The eyelets are above and below which where the stitches kind of uh, lace just like you would see on a baseball or on a football. As you can see the suture line at 10 days is undetectable. What this tells me is a couple things. One, I have a good patient, and two, we did a great job. So between the two of us working together, we got a terrific suture line, which will be completely undetectable as that continues to heal throughout the year. Um, okay, so anyway, so here is that suture line. You can see how beautiful it looks. This little redness and uh, irritated areas just because we took the stitches out. These short hairs are gonna grow back over time, and this completely covers.